Hey you guys, I'm gonna show you the little bit that I've done for my fall. I guess this is gonna be like my fall tour because I don't see myself getting anything. <laughs> um, so let me turn you around. Remember, I live here and there's three pets. So, all right. If you like this, please like and subscribe and share. So we have kind of like an open concept here and uh, usually throughout the year i decorate with a lot of pink and that right there are boxes that hide remotes and things like that i put this together it's inside the pottery barn uh planter that they have and that book i just i like it it looks nice so yeah uh, this is our haunted closet where I just keep some creepy plants. There's uh, my girls and my son's bedroom over there. This is the entryway. Hey! And that's where we put our shoes. And that's my blanket ladder. Alright, uh, let me slowly take you around. I'm drinking a Coke Zero and I'm watching YouTube while filming YouTube. So this is uh, the colors that we have in the house. And right here, let me, is a squirrel. It's not your typical colors. Um, it's a squirrel with some pink and uh pine cones and everything and all the pine cones that you see that i have are pine cones i've collected since being here that's my fiddle fig it's still alive <laughs> um this is the garland that i've been working on because i had the flower stems already so i just needed like a base for them and that's what i have there there's this random table. I don't know what to do with it, but I love the shape, so it's not going anywhere. And if you see the owls, they are so cute. And I glued mushrooms to there. And in here, I keep my, let me set this down. My kids call them old lady candies, okay? But there were those originals, and they're amazing. So here we have just some random art that I have, some pine cones and uh, pumpkins. This is the mantle that I worked on. And there's a squirrel, that's a picture that I took. And I love my monkey, I love him so much. And these, this is the garland right here. And I have navy blue pumpkins because I do have a lot of blue in my house. And I just got this print. Don't laugh. I think it's hilarious. I have that corner over there for fall. This is the dining table. It's not fully set because I don't want to keep utensils out or anything. When we come and eat, we just move the top plate and set our plate on top of that. The kitchen for fall, it's not that big. These are my vintage owls that I have. And I put together this tear tray. It's just something, you know? And I have some more plants over here. And my dog crate is normally in my room. But because I'm not babysitting or doing anything, I have that there. So that's kind of it. So yeah, uh, that's kind of all that I have going on. Some of these stems I got at Hobby Lobby. Uh, some of the other stems I found, well, somebody was getting rid of them. And uh, I'm like, are you getting rid of that? They're like, yes. And I'm like, oh, can I have it? So that's how it worked out. Um, the chandelier is from West Elm and uh, just, you know, 
up, I upcycle, I do that stuff. Get a, get a few good pieces that can anchor a room. Like, you know, I'm letting the dogs in right now. Um, like right there, my facet furniture hutch. That helps ground the dining room with the funky chairs. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And again, please like and subscribe. It really helps. Um, I hope I can get to 70 subscribers or 100. No, let's aim high. Let's say seven, 100 subscribers. We'll see. That means I gotta put out more content. I need to go out more. But now that my husband's working at like a regular job, we can't do the you know i got something going on type of thing so all right i'll talk to you guys later much love